Hello and welcome! Today I will be showing you how to make some super easy shrinky dinks. To start off, you will need to either print or sketch out the designs you want. They need to be about three times the size you actually want it. I did the drawings about four inches tall and they ended up being about an inch when it was done. Here I have sketched out the designs I want to do and I'm just using a dark pen to go over the lines to make it easier to see. material you will need that you will draw the designs onto is number 6 plastic. I got these plastic tins from eating out a while ago, so the next time you see plastic like this, be sure to save it. Once I've cut out some even sheets of this plastic, I will trace my designs onto it with a sharpie, and any color will work. Next, you will cut out your designs. I am trying to cut as close to the outlines as possible. Next, I will preheat my oven to 300 degrees Fahrenheit. Then I will put some tin foil on a baking sheet and then place my cutout designs on top of that. I leave them in the oven for roughly 3-5 to five minutes, but just keep an eye on it. Besides, this is the funnest part watching them shrink. You will know when they are done once they have stopped curling and are laying somewhat flat again. If they are still slightly curled when you take them out, press something cool and flat on top of them, like a glass cup. For the designing part, I will be using acrylic paints. If you paint on the back side, the color will still show through, but you will still have that smooth texture on the front. So that is what I did with mine. Once I've painted the colors I want, I will do one last layer of white on the back to hide all of the colors and make it nice looking. Once the paint has dried, I will put a layer of Mod Podge over it to seal in all of the paint. Then I will use some E600 glue, or hot glue works as well, and these pin backings. And I'm going to glue these to the backs. If you don't have these specific pins, safety pins work great as well. And we're finished. Be sure to subscribe for more videos like these, and as always, thanks for watching!